What's up, YouTube? It's Ma here. And I'm playing some Domination on Hanoi with a silenced MP5K using Lightweight, Slate of Hand, and Ninja. And my kill streaks are my usual biplane, counter spy plane, and the awesome Blackbird. And yeah, I don't know. When I was playing this, like, I had super ears, I don't know, like, I can hear almost anything, and I was kind of hyper too, so if you see me playing, like, I don't know, just itchy, I guess, I don't know what you can call it, but, yeah, that's why, I do pretty good too, but, today is Monday, January 31st, yeah, I know a few of you were like, hey, map pack's coming out tomorrow, yeah, the Black Ops First Strike map packs are being released tomorrow, and I'm going to try and get them. Well, I'm not going to try. I'm going to get them, and, well, let's talk about some of these maps. So, instead of talking about Discovery, Berlin Wall, Stadium, or Kowloon, Let's just jump right into the map Ascension for Nazi zombies. Or Black Ops zombies, whatever you want to call them. Um, I've seen, I don't know who did the breakdown of the video. I think it was someone from Next Gen Tactics. Um, it was like Rad Austin 7, something like that. He did, um, I don't know how people do breakdowns like that. They'll like see like littlest thing and they're like oh this means this and then that means that and then that doesn't mean that this happens no I don't know but he did a pretty good breakdown of it um there's been rumors that the world at war Nazi zombie wonder I don't know how to pronounce it whatever but there's been rumors that that gun's gonna be coming back and I never got the chance to use it I did play Nazi zombies but I didn't um, play that much actually. I only played it a little bit. But um, I looked it up and it actually looks like a pretty cool gun. Still kind of weird on how it works, but um, there's two new colas that are supposed or er, power ups or perks, whatever, that are supposed to be um, coming out with that map and. I don't even, I can't even like think of what they might be because there's already Slate of Hand, there's Jugger, there's Quick Revive, there's Double Tap, like what else do you need? Probably like Tack Mask maybe? Um, cause you know no one's gonna be needing like Ninja Cola or something like that for like freaking Ghost or Ninja or whatever. I don't know. But. There's also two, like, new equipments. I don't know what you want to call them. The first one, I, I don't even know the names of them. But the first one I noticed was the, um... It's like a Russian doll. And I don't know if everyone knows what that is. It's like those weird, overly kind of doll things that you open it, and there's another one that's a little bit smaller in it, and you open it, and you keep doing that for, like, four dolls. But, um, what that is, is pretty much a cluster bomb. That you'll just throw it down on the ground, and then it'll explode. And then, like, two more grenades will come from that, and it'll explode. And then probably a few more grenades will come from that and explode, and then it'd be done. And then the second type of, um, equipment, or whatever you want to call it, that, um, that they're bringing to it is like a black hole grenade kind of like you'll throw it and then zombies will just be like sucked into it and then it's like bye bye zombies yeah and they said that there might be another new gun but um not sure what it would be anyways we've all just gotta wait and see it's only tomorrow <laughs> um Okay, onto the actual multiplayer maps. We've got 
Stadium, Berlin Wall, Discovery, and um, Kowloon. Yeah. So Stadium looks like a pretty fun map. It looks like a small to medium sized map compared to all the other maps they have on Black Ops already. And it looks pretty cool because it doesn't seem to have been shown that there are any camping spots, which is really fun. Because getting camped on is not fun at all. It's really annoying. Um. Seems like a run and gunner is a paradise, actually. Pretty much me. <laughs> let's see. The next map would be... Let's go with Discovery. Um, Discovery is the map that has, like, the... Like, the iced bridge, kind of. That you can put, like, a C4 on it or something like that. And it'll just explode and collapse to some part. Some part, I guess. I don't know why I said it weird. And... I don't know, that looks kind of campish. Oh, on the dashboard, they had like a breakdown of all the maps. And, um, not sure how they worded it, but they pretty much said to do good on Discovery. You have to, like, dominate the chokehold points. And as soon as I heard that, I was like, oh boy, there's gonna be a lot of camping on that map. Yeah. Camping is so fun, Treyarch. I don't know why you guys like it. It's fucking annoying. Excuse my language. <sighs> but then, let's go to... No, there's still something on um, Discovery I want to say that... Um, there's, like, some... I don't know, they put, like, one half of the map that the sky's, like, neon green. Like, um, just like neon green and like semi ghosty. I don't know how how to explain it, but that's like their main way of saying, "Hey, you're on this side of the map," or "You're on that side of the map." Like, don't make the map another. What what would it be? Um, another like wet work type map from COD Four where. It's pretty much exactly the same on either side. Because I think it's symmetrical. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the word symmetrical is. That symmetrical maps are extremely boring. Because you can only go straight. You can't go to the right and try and flank to the left. No, you just gotta walk straight and hope no one kills you before you go to the other side and try and kill them. Hopefully that map isn't symmetrical. But, um, next map would be, um, Kowloon. I can't even pay attention. I don't, I don't even know what maps I'm talking about. But, Kowloon. That's the map with, um, with the zip line. And one of the first things I thought when I saw the zip line was, can I just dolphin dive down that with, like, lightweight pro instead of having to go on the zip line? Because I'm pretty sure that'd be pretty fun. Being able to dolphin dive down it. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Um, it looks pretty cool. It looks like a pretty cool map. Um, there seems to be like a lot of um, rooftop to rooftop jumping. And it's happened to everyone. Where you just fall off the map. Yeah, I don't want to be out, be running around with a stoner. And be running slower than an elephant or something. Where I run and then I barely get the edge. And it says press A to jump. Or press X for people who use PS3. Um, and then it's just like, um, nah, you should have known to press A or X. So you could have jumped up, but no. Like, make the gaps a little bit smaller so the guys with L and LMGs, yeah, LMGs, can make the jumps too. But other than that, it looks pretty cool because um, it's a different ta um, different take than just 
running on the ground like you can hop rooftops and stuff that looks pretty cool and um the last map would be berlin wall and the berlin wall actually has some historic background to it not the map the actual two words berlin wall and i'm not gonna go into detail on that right now but or ever pretty much because i'm not a history teacher but it looks pretty cool i like i don't know the the sentry guns or whatever they are that's shooting at anyone that seems kind of stupid to me unless like there are ways to dodge them instead of just like running through hopelessly every single time i don't know i just Everyone will have to see everyone on Xbox. Sorry, people with PS3s again. But everyone on Xbox will be able to see tomorrow. And yeah, this video is coming to a close. I end up going 41 and 18. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys later. Have a good one, everyone.